Nearly five years on and there's hardly any progress on this piggery project, the would-be beneficiaries are crying foul. They claim the project has been taken away from them. It has now been expanded to the whole community despite the little progress. Aspiring farmers say the biggest challenge is not having the infrastructure to house their pigs. It's, it's affecting us very bad because we're expecting a lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of uh, improvement for our community as well. Because uh, this project, it doesn't belong to us only. Our future generation. We went to workshops, but now it is said that this project belonged to the whole community. Now our pigs are living in poor conditions. This project, this project has affected us very bad. My mom passed on. They have been attending workshops to no avail. Even now, animals are there. We're just waiting for the project or proper infrastructure. We also call him for assistance with the market, where we can take our animals to. We thought municipality is going to assist us. In 2017, the Mangawung Metro Municipality allocated about 1 million rand for the project. 400,000 rand of that money was paid to a contractor, but not much has materialized. Part of the delay is that you remember in the last time the project was uh, started, but it had its own hiccups. What happened to the department through Maine? Mr. Maine has started again and uh, ours is just to appoint the contractor because the entire work has been done. The consultants have done plans and designs. So all that has to happen in this financial year, meaning that ours is just to appoint the contractor so that uh, people on the ground can start with this bigger project. These prospective beneficiaries say they received training on how to run the project. They also say a certificate for permission to occupy was also issued. Apumelele Mzalane, SABC News, Tabanchu.